Each day, sunrise, I'm feeling optimistic more and more toward the future, although the, uh, the difficult situation and although the uh, difficult reality, but I'm daily more optimistic toward the future. My name is uh, Moad Abou. Uh, I am 30 years old. I was born in Hebron, in uh, West Bank, in Palestine. I'm uh, married. I have a daughter, she is now one year old. My hobby is, first of all, uh, internet, browsing, and, uh, reading, sharing stories and videos. Second, swimming, but the problem is in West Bank, we cannot access the sea. The sea is under the Israeli control, so it's a big issue for the Palestinians. The Palestinian people haven't any problem with the Jewish people. Our problem is only with the occupation. I'm just seeing that Moad responded to a movie that I uploaded a few days ago. The movie was taken in a protest that was here in Tel Aviv during the bombings in Gaza in, in the south of Israel and a lot of Israelis, Jewish and Israelis, Palestinian chanted that we refuse to be enemies and we refuse to let the government define us. I met Moad uh, through the Yala page on Facebook Actually, I have a lot of friends in the Facebook, but no one is Palestinian. Moad really reminds me my best friend, uh, which, which is Israeli. It was funny and the attitude to, to the war is quite similar. Last time I communicated with Palestinian was in the army. It's so much different than... Uh, I'm describing Yuval. He is sometimes too funny and sometimes you can feel he's too serious. Maybe this is related to the topics or the issues that we are dealing in the daily life as Palestinians and Israelis. Yeah, I would love to meet more people like uh, Yuval from Israel. And I know there is many people like, like Yuval. And by the way, the, the social media give us the opportunity to meet people like Yuval. This is a story we cannot uh, hear it in uh, in the TVs or in the newspapers. We hear a lot about the Palestinians when there are bombings, the rockets and terror attacks and that is what we know about them from the media. The newspapers and the TV is just uh, watching us what they want to, uh, to wo what they want us to watch and they are uh, 
only sharing the stories that action stories and, and their point of view. I guess it's also like that on the other side and they see Israel as a army and soldiers and I think it's really good for war not to know anything about each other but for peace it's quite bad. The social media helped us to, to see these voices in Israel and many voices in Israel uh, calling for ending the, the occupation. I want the Palestinians to know that I don't want this war and I have the same interest as the individuals. I just want a peaceful environment. Let's see.